Gates on the board, the former UK and Masters champion. And in this, his sixth Crucible semi-final, he's got his nose in front in the next frame too. It's one of those shots where you've just got to judge the pace, isn't it? <coughs> Has he judged it perfectly? One. You betcha. Good shot. Matthew, what have you done there? That was very careless. Eight. Got himself in amongst the balls and just playing to hit that full ball. And he's snookered himself on the intended red. What a mistake. Already 23 in the lead. That was a good chance to push on. He's already had two chances in this frame and had to play safe. He's having to do it again. Matthew Stevens, eight. Yeah, just a delicate little cannon, but he misjudged it badly. Let's see what Hawkeye was. Uh, he's pretty shrewd old Hawkeye there. Yeah, that would have done him. He's coming around to look at the potting angle, which tells you he's going to take this on. Amazingly enough, there's a gap in between the blue and the green, which is the path the white could be taking. It might go very close to enough here. Or is it far too thin? But after a series of little kisses, I think he's got away with it. sudden a uh, little <laughs> smile from Ronnie and um, it's as if that interval has uh, changed everything around I'm not sure I could find an example of the drag shot earlier on but it doesn't look like Matthew's playing it you just got to hope the white keeps the true path here and just play for the pink or the black look a bit hard well Still okay for the pink though. I'm not sure if he can just stun in between the reds and leave the white somewhere near there. harder than he intended but he's got the one to the middle pocket also he played for that one that's just above the black but the pink will be available after he puts the one to the right middle so I think the pink will be available into the right corner I'm not sure we'll find out the way Matthew plays this shot no it wouldn't go that's why he's Eight. played back for the black Just not getting into the cue ball at all. 50. Six or seven inches shorter than where he wanted to play there. Good recovery though. Oh, that's flew off the cushion. 16. Goodness me, it took off. I can't believe how fast that came off the cushion. 
let's, let's have a look at it again. Yeah. Oh, it picked up pace, didn't it? Good recovery, though. Very good recovery. And he's just looking to see if the pink 18. will go in the right middle. So he must be near enough straight on this red. Well, there's a slight angle, but he's okay. 19. And you can see he's growing in confidence with each shot, Matthew Stevens. And I think this is the speed he needs to play. I mean, he's at 28 seconds a shot at the minute because he's been bogged down. Just needs to kick on a little bit now. 25. 26. Mind he hasn't had many chances, has he, in around the black and pink spot area? 33. In the first five frames. 34. That equals his highest break, or only just a 66. You would have expected it to be a little bit higher, but the frames have gone rather awkward. 42. 42. <coughs> Excuse me, it's not ideal on this blue. He could screw directly. Up into them, or go off two cushions. Nice play to flare. I can only presume this red pot here. 70 point lead, of course. It is uh, just one red away from 47. making the frame safe. Well done, Matthew Stevens. 48. Kept up the table for the first four frames. Could have lost the fifth. All of a sudden. As I say that, Matthew Ronnie O'Sullivan was looking at the scoreboard as he decided to play on. He will play on, but barring a number of snookers, Matthew Stevens will get another frame on the board, but still trail 4 2. And that was indeed enough to halve the deficit between these two semi finalists. So Stevens briskly and decisively back into this match. great talent probably should have done more in the game and he'll say that himself but obviously a very very great player in terms of his talent and his game he should have been at the top of the rankings his whole career and he should have won so many more tournaments he's a man that rises to the big occasions all the time every player plays better with confidence and he's certainly getting that under his belt I think people enjoy watching him playing the way he goes about his business he doesn't mess about very fluent very attacking it's such a lovely fella. Every, every time we see each other, we always talk about our kids. Great, great guy. So we'll always have a laugh. Been in all kinds of finals, 13 or 14 finals in his career. Underachiever. If he wants it enough, then he could go out and win the titles. If he was a bit more serious, he'd win a lot more tournaments.